Today we're going to talk about how to comment inside JavaScript. And I think this is something that's quite important for you to know since at one point when you have a really big website, it can be quite difficult to distinguish some code from another, which means that commenting can actually be used to write an explanation to what code does what inside our code. So the first one we're going to learn how to do is commenting out a single line. Now, as you guys can see, I have two lines of code down here, and this is actually the example from the previous episode. And I'm just going to go ahead and comment out the console log line that we have here by writing backslash backslash. Now, everything in front of the backslash is not going to be a comment, but everything to the right side of it is going to be commented out. And it's only going to be this line of code here. So I could actually use this comment to either write on the right side of it, like here, I could write something, or I could write the comment on top of it to just explain what exactly this code does. Now, let's say I want to comment out more than one line of code. I can actually go ahead and do it the same way as CSS, where you write backslash star. As you guys can see, I automatically commented out everything inside the script tags because you know everything after these symbols gets commented out. If I want to close the comment, I need to write star backslash, you know, just reversed. And now everything between these tags is going to be a comment. As you guys can see, if I move it up to the next line, you know, the second line does not get commented out because like I said, everything in between the tags gets commented. And that's basically it. I don't think that this episode should be longer than this because it's just simple commenting. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time.